border border operators have been marked to instigating the culture of impunity and lawlessness, especially when the country is approaching the general election. The unending impunity now seeing a section of stakeholders in the government hasten its steps in preventing a repeat of chaos witnessed in 2017 general elections by mapping out the potential hotspots across the country. <laughs> Eh, wewe pia pengine unaenda unapigwa bili yako ni shilingi 1200 kwa hospitali na haiwezi kukulipia ama mnataka kwenda kuishi hospitali kama umekatwa mapanga We want na kitu kingine yenye mnafahamu jui We as the riders we depend on our daily income While meeting a section of border border riders from across the eight regions in Nairobi county Interior PS Karanja Kibicho has attributed the chaos to be induced from their day-to-day -day frustrations. Some of these things, as we try to joke with them as border border sector, because you'll be used, no, the consequences can be dire. Journey with you towards a more peaceful Kenya, so that in 2007-2008, Haita Fanyika Tena, and that is what we want to commit ourselves today. Earlier this year, Interior CS Fred Matiangi began a campaign that included data collection and analysis on the potential hotspots that are likely to cause a stir during the 2022 general election. In most cases, uh, politicians use the youth. So it's, it's important that uh, we sensitize the youth on the importance of keeping peace during this electioneering uh, time. This is after reports circulated of alleged political leaders planning to use the youth and border border operators to create chaos. Milo Kisenya for K24 TV.